Hi guys, uh, so I wanted to do an unboxing. This is from Amazon. I took it out of the larger box because I got it delivered with other things. Um, but this is my new Filofax. So it came in this white box that was basically just large enough to fit this box. And now we will open this box. So I got a new Filofax because, oh, I don't know what this is. Oh. It's not about wallets. I'm not really going to be buying a new wallet. But I guess that's good to know. I don't know. And I got another pack of these, these jot pad things, um, which I have from before and I didn't use. So I don't really know that I'm going to use that. I think I'll just immediately put that in the de-stash pile, to be honest. Um, so, and I saved these boxes because I put, um, whatchamacallit, in them like other planner stuff when I am storing stuff. So these boxes are convenient to have, I think. So I'll just set that aside. So I ordered um, a new Filofax, not because I don't love my Malden, but actually because I love my Malden so much. So what I did is I got it in the quote Kingfisher it's called. I don't know why it's called Kingfisher. I don't care. I was pumped. So it's the exact same one everything is the same it's just a different color because I like super love that planner like I don't even know how to appropriately describe how much I really love my Malden um but I feel like that purple is like it's a very like fall color to me so I was like you know what I'm gonna get a new one I'm gonna get it in to me this is like a teal or an aqua but they call it kingfisher I don't know um, sorry, I'm just getting rid of all the extra packaging. So they call it Kingfisher, and I got this on Amazon. I want to say it was, like, just under 130 So it's, like, not an amount of money that I should have been spending. But, like, also, I was really pumped about it. Um, so the same as the other one, it has the front pocket. It has, like, a wallet size pocket here and a card wallet size pocket here, a longer pocket here, a longer pocket here, the pocket that goes the full width, and then the zipper pocket. Again, um, it has the pen loop up front. We'll flip to the back really quick. Um, it has this pocket here, which goes all the way down, and then it has another pen loop. Um, this back here does not open. The stitching will show you that it doesn't open, but in case you were wondering, oh, does this open in the back? It does not. Um, it does come with one of the top loading pockets here, um, and it also comes with inserts. I didn't buy it for the inserts. I love my So Much Crafting inserts. Um, however, and I might actually, see I wanna show you guys what's in here, but like I don't need this all to be separated. But I do wanna show you what's in here, so I'll open it. Um, but I do like that it comes packaged that way so that the pages don't flip flop all around and get stuck behind the rings and everything. This is to protect the leather from the rings. Um, and then it does have dividers, which I have my own and my friend and I are going to make new ones, but it comes with six dividers. It comes with to-do list, um, inserts. I think they try to give you an idea of like what Filofax has if you wanna buy them, but you can get these. Um, you can get very similar ones, I believe from Filofaxy, and you can just search online for them as well. Um, but you can also buy them. I buy my inserts from So Much Crafting. I love her inserts a lot. Um, we have the lined inserts. Um, graph paper inserts. They have this bar thing at the top. We have some blank page inserts. This is the A5 size. A5 is very, very close to the half letter size. I think A5 is just slightly different. Uh, they have contacts. So if you want to put like an address book type deal, um, I don't keep that. They also have, here we go the colored pages, the colored line pages, blue, green, and pink. And then you get into their actual planner. And because I bought this in 2017, it does come with the 2017, um, whatchamacallit. So you have personal information, which you can have in different languages, religious festivals for 2017, national information, and information for, I don't know, claiming rewards or something or other. I don't know. 
Um, they suggest something about a tablet case, not something I'm planning on doing. I have my own tablet case, I'm good. Uh, holiday symbols, and then it has like an hourly layout. And this layout is actually very similar to my current planner. Uh, mine is lined, it's not um, given times though as well, but it is lined. And it just has times from eight to eight, and then a little bit of space at the bottom for like a this week deal, along with a little baby like month view. Um, it does do Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, like my current planner slash inserts. But again, I did not buy these for the inserts. And it'll go through the entire year. I'll probably ask my coworker if she would like these. She got the horizontal, and I will probably offer her these in case she wants to try the vertical. Um, at the very end, there are more blank note pages. Um, and then they tell you about, I don't know, more accessories that you can buy on Filofax. And the fact that this is an A5 and it, every one contains the past, present, future calendar information, personal information, national information, religious festivals, and notable dates, all of which we covered. Um, and then also comes with the, as I said, the top loading um, folder pocket thing. Um, also in the middle is just one of these little bookmarks. Um, so it marks your page, it's also a ruler. This is not something that I typically carry personally. I don't, I just don't, um, it's not my jam. I use Ollie Clips to mark my pages instead of this. So this is not something I will be using, but it's something that people can use. So I will set that aside. I'll put it in my D stash pile to see if my coworker wants it. Um, but that's it. I'll probably keep the line pages separate. And then, like I said, I'll see if my coworker wants those inserts. Um, but that is it. So that is my unboxing. I love the fact that it has two pen loops. I love the fact that it has, you know, these pockets. And I'm just really happy with the general layout. I like, it's a very like soft feeling leather. Um, I believe this is real leather. I'm not really sure to be honest, but I really like it either way. But I do just feel like it is very plush. Like it's something that I like having. I did have two other binder systems, which you can see in if you, I'm not really gonna link them below because I feel like it's not really that big a deal. But I had a Carpe Diem, um, which I liked a lot, and it was my first one, but like it did feel very fake leather. Um, it was almost like plasticky, and that's also, and I mean, not really also, it's the Webster's I found was like even worse for that plasticky feel over the leather, whereas this is very much like, it, it feels like leather. Um, I don't know if it's real leather or if it's just really good imitation leather. I feel like based on the price, it's probably real leather. And it's re it's just really nice. Um, so I don't know. If you are on the fence about do I want to buy a Filofax, do I not? I would say definitely um, for the Malden, look to see if you can find one that is cheaper. Either in sellers, pages, um, different Facebook groups, Instagram eBay look there first I got both of mine on Amazon and they were both over a hundred dollars both were around 120 however that's still much cheaper than the Filofax website had them and that was up near like 160 so you can find them for cheaper than Filofax themselves has them I don't recommend spending the 160 they're really nice planners but I just feel like you could think about any weekly kits you could buy <laughs> with that forty dollars you're saving um, so I do suggest that, plus with these being from, well, with this one and the other one as well, both being from Amazon and I have Prime shipping, I got them in two days. This one I think actually came the next day. Um, so this one came in like 24 hours, whereas the first one I think was two days. So like that's something else to keep in mind because if you order from Filofax and if you order from eBay and whatever, like it's going to take longer than two days. So I was very happy with this. I can't wait to move everything into this and bring this one to school. My coworkers will think that I'm nuts, but I don't care. I can't wait. I'm really pumped. Um, now that I'm kind of investigating it, I do see a little bit of discoloration down here. There's like some black smudging. Um, I'm not sure that I super mind because it's not super noticeable. I don't know if you can really tell. It's like right here. Um, so it's not super noticeable to me, so I'm not sure that I mind, but it is something to be aware of. I could probably honestly contact Amazon and let them know about it, but then I would have to ship this one back, and even though I would, it would be replaced, it's just, to me, more of a hassle. Um, 
and it's probably not something that I would notice. Honestly, my other one got scuffed up a bit just from everyday usage, so this one probably will too, so to me, it's it's gonna end up more scuffed. But that's one of the things that I actually really like about the other my other Filofax is that even though it is like a bit scuffed and worn, it's still, like that kind of adds to the, how do I wanna say, like the personality almost of the planner. Um, the personality of the leather like it doesn't look trashy to me it just looks used because of the way the leather is it's kind of has like imperfections anyway so it's not like wow that's super obvious you're just like well yeah that's that might be something that's wrong with it or it might be the way that the leather was made to begin with um but that's my personal feeling not everyone's gonna feel that way maybe this little mark down here is something that you would throw if it over that's definitely your prerogative and when you're paying 120 to 130 dollars for a single planner. I feel like you definitely have that, you know, privilege and right to make that big deal. Um, but that is everything. So I hope you guys enjoy this. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them below and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Um, if you would like to stick around, I try to post new videos at least twice a week. Now that I am out of my grad classes, I'm starting to get into three times a week because I'm doing the rewind, the, the rewind. That's a cool story. The rewind spreads. So I'm getting into three times a week over twice a week. Um, that'll probably last through, well, in the fall, I'm only taking one class. So it might actually last until like mid-January. We'll see what happens. I'm going to try to keep it at, you know, three videos because I feel like the rewind is a nice touch. Um, but it might actually stop because in January, my one week spreads will be done. And I don't know if I'm going to rebuy that system. We'll have to see what happens. Um, but yeah, so that is everything. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up so that I know that this is the kind of content that you enjoy. Have a fantastic week. Bye, guys.